What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's DGFX or Nick, whatever the fuck you want to call me. Um, today we are playing some Hardpoint on, I think, Breach? I don't know, whatever. Aquarium, Aquarium. Um, and today it's not just any day. Today we are reviewing the VMP, the second submachine gun you unlock. I uh, can't remember exactly at this point what level you unlock it at, but it's within the first 10... Um, levels so i decided instead of just getting a good gameplay and you know commentating over it that maybe i'll try something different and do a live commentary now the reason for this is because it actually allows me to actually kind of tell you guys how it feels in my hands um you know how it feels actually get like an active description of and not just be like yeah it's a cool gun here's a bunch of stats i mean none of y'all really give a shit if you put a gun on and it killed three bullets or it has a 1.5 multiplayer. No one really gives a shit about that. Um, you know? So, I'm actonally gonna give y'all kind of like a better understanding of it. And, so far, this gun to me is a hard point, um, headquarters gun. Something with a lot of closed quarters. Usually playing in tight little spaces like this in buildings. I use this gun a lot in free for all and I love it. What's so good about it is, it's because it kills really quick. And this game is all about getting the advantage and having a faster gun. Um, now I'm going towards like a assault rifle, or like the Man of War. That's extremely so far right. Uh, this gun does a lot better. So this is pretty much the definition of a submachine gun with a fast fire rate. I'm using the grip and quick draw, and it's just it's perfect. Like this is probably my favorite sight out of all Call of Duties. And the reason is this is because it's not I don't know it just like when I look at it sometimes, like this gun like right now, a quick glance, it don't even look like you have a sight on it. It's just, it's so, I don't know, it almost looks like you have these arms, but yet you don't at the same time. You do start off with 40 bullets. Oh shit. You start off with 40 bullets and you have 120 extra uh, to do what you need to do. And to me, that is perfect. If you want to run X in the max, I would run X in the max if you're playing like ground war, something with a lot more people. Um, you know, sometimes maybe you might need it if it's a hard point game where there's tons of people just constantly running in there. And this gun is very versatile. I can, you know, I feel it feels good moving around the map in it. Um, it's a map. It's a gun. I feel like I can just run around. And, oh god! I just hit him in the face with a frag. It shoots well on the water, guys. Well, this is pretty much it for this video, guys. I hope y'all like this. Uh, I mean, there's not really much more I can talk about this gun. Uh, like I said, I'd rather talk to you about the gun, how it actually feels in the hands, and, uh, you know, a live commentary with it, actually how it's working, than just come there and do a video of just saying a bunch of stats that you'll probably won't even use. Because, I mean, like I said, no one really gives a shit about uh, if it has a certain level of damage per hit and stuff. Um, I'd rather show you guys how it actually feels. And what it can do, I feel that's a little bit more useful to you guys and what to do to set it up. That's pretty much it in the video, guys. I hope you all like and comment. And check out with me in the description. I'm trying, to, like I said, I'm still trying to keep upload streak. I think I'm going on almost 20 uploads now. Um, not too sure, but I'll have to check that out. That's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And later.